And let's begin with the crushing blow to President Joe Biden's plan to cancel student loan debt for millions of Americans. Willie James Immen is at the Supreme Court with more on the decision. The Supreme Court threw out the Biden administration's $400 billion plan to offer student loan relief to millions of Americans. In a 6-3 to three ruling, the conservative majority rejected the administration's argument that the HEROES Act allowed it to waive student loan rules during the pandemic. The justice is saying the administration overstepped its authority. The last thing the court really said here is, in order for the Secretary of Education to do this, he needs a clearer sign from Congress. He needs express authorization. In her dissent, Justice Alina Kagan said Congress had authorized the plan, but that the court overrides the combined judgment of the legislative and executive branches, with the consequence of eliminating loan forgiveness for 43 million Americans. The White House had been watching closely for the court's decision, and after the ruling, President Biden said he'll keep fighting for debt relief. Today's decision has closed one path. Now we're going to pursue another. I'm never going to stop fighting for you. We'll use every tool at our disposal to get you the student debt relief you need and reach your dreams. Borrowers had hoped for a different outcome. We're here for justice. We are here for dignity. And we are here for President Biden to keep his promise. We need a plan B. We need it now. Student loan payments have been on hiatus since the start of the pandemic. With the courts ruling, those bills would be due again within months. Willie James Inman, CBS News, at the Supreme Court. Now, leaders and lawmakers from here in Arkansas have been weighing in on the decisions all day. We've been compiling them, and you can read them right now on THV11.com.